across America with Mega Jackpots. It's Mega Millions. With no jackpot winner since April, the current Mega Millions grand prize has grown to more than $1 billion. The mega sized jackpot has generated a lot of ticket sales. Now, some viewers want to know do the odds of winning Mega Millions change depending on how many tickets are sold or how long it's been since a winner? Let's verify. Our sources are Mega Millions and Joshua Johnston, the director of Washington's Lottery. According to Mega Millions, the odds of winning the jackpot are about 1 in 302.6 million. Since the numbers never change, those odds remain the same, regardless of how many tickets are sold or the size of the jackpot. No, the odds do not change depending on the amount of tickets sold. It doesn't matter if there's if it's $20 million or a billion dollars, the odds are the same. But what if no one has won in a long time? Do the odds of someone winning a jackpot improve? Well, the odds of the jackpot getting hit do increase because we are seeing a lot more people play. So the more people that play, um, the more combinations that are being used and therefore the, the likelihood of it getting hit does go up. So more tickets sold means it's more likely there will be a winner, but what can you do to improve your odds? If somebody is looking for a way to improve their chances of winning, that is by, you know, purchasing more tickets. You have just a greater, op greater opportunity. But beware, while buying more tickets with different combinations will improve your odds, winning remains a huge long shot. Here are just a few things more likely to happen than winning the jackpot. They include getting struck by lightning, attacked by a shark, or becoming president of the United States.